How's it going guys, girls, and me pals? I'm Alice in Wonderland, your favorite Kiwi trans girl, and the other day I got a really weird notification. It said, Alice, you dumb bitch. I feel like the insult was a little bit unnecessary. There are horny singles in your DMs. And I thought, again? That's right, the DM tanks have been reloaded. Ka-chow! And they've not been reloaded for just any old DMs video. This is in fact the 10th episode of Trans Girl Reacts to Unhinged DMs. And not only that, it's also our 5,000 subscriber special episode! That's right, to celebrate 5,000 subscribers, we have a special super episode, and at the end I have a special new segment where I look at some of your worst ever DMs. Stick around because it's pretty fucking mental. But uh, before we get started, just give me a second. Just feel like I gotta, you know, dress for the occasion. You asked for it, you got it. No one asked for it, I just really wanted to wear my pink suit. That's enough time wasted with the intro. Let's get into some DMs. Girl, I want to see where you poop from. Silly child, don't you know that girls don't poop? Also, that's just f***ing gross. Damn, girl, are you sitting on the F5 key? Cause that ass is refreshing. Oh really? If it's so refreshing, why don't you f***ing drink it? What I just said has really strange implications. Are you lightning? Because I want to make you McQueen. Ka-chow! I don't even know what to say. What the f***? Is that? What the hell? What conceivable notion jumped into your head that caused you to jump onto your computer, download an image of Lightning McQueen, cut out the wheels, and put on legs? Whoever made this needs to be shot. I am personally offended. Stop being so hot. I can't take it anymore. What we do here is push boundaries. You say you can't take it anymore? I think you can. Let's see just how far this goes. Fish. <laughs> this is exactly my sense of humor. Why does this make me laugh? It's just he's, he's so well dressed. I feel like I have to trade with him. I feel like I have to take him to a table in New York City, just south of Wall Street, and talk over drinks about how we're going to ruin the economy. Hey, why there is no men with you in your pics? Probably because they're working in the mines where a man belongs. Shoveling coal. Either that or they're dressed up in a maid outfit on the front lines of my queer army. Gosh, you're pretty. I'm sorry to be a weirdo, but am I allowed to masturbate to your photos, please? You gotta give him props. At least he asked permission. Not like the guy that sent me a cum tribute. You are awesome. An inspiration. Thank you. Amazing dress. Sorry that this message just comes out of nowhere. Just thank you so, so, so much for restoring hope in me. I'm just a trans girl living in a transphobic family, and seeing someone being themselves gives me so much happiness. I'm touched. You're so welcome. I... I wish I could help more. <laughs> Slim! I have no idea what he was trying to say. Come on, don't be shy. Show daddy a little something. What about this minigun? Is this lil enough for you? Hi, BB, who are you? I am a fan of you. I want to ask you a request, please. I love your body and I want to see your dick. <laughs> My friend, the dick ship has sailed over the horizon to distant pastures, to clearer waters where there are no such thing as by, by the time this video is released, my d*** will no longer exist. My name is Patrick. It's nice to meet you. I'm from Melbourne, Australia. Pass! Australian? Not interested. May I ask how old you are? I am infinite! My age knows no bounds. I'm 23. Unrelated, but I am skilled at throwing cans of soup at people if you want more range in the army. I need more information. What kind of soup can you throw? What is in your armament? I'm assuming this is kind of like a grenade situation. Obviously, you're gonna have high explosive grenades. You're gonna have flashbangs. Should I assume that baked beans are shrapnel grenades? Can we meet? No. No Bible, only cow. I much prefer this to Genesis. Uh, it reminds me of the good old days in the future where I'm gonna be wearing a cowkini. 
I do actually have a Kaokini, that's not a joke. Consider that your 7,500 subscriber goal. You know what to do. Share my channel if you want to see me in a Kaokini. I'm not going to be milked, though. I will... I will put that stipulation in there. This is a holdup! I'm stealing your gender expression! Because of gender envy. I don't think you realize just how much bigger my gun is than yours! <laughs> no, my friend. It is I that will be stealing your gender expression! Hi, are you MTF? Yes. Can my cat join your army? She may dislike Christmas trees, but she dislikes Ohio even more. She's got spirit, this one. I like her. We need moral support in the barracks, you know? Sometimes it's good to have a fluffy, friendly thing that's not actually just a furry. What? How? There's no message. Hey girl, are you part of the alphabet gang? Because you're an LGBTQT. That is a brilliant pickup line. And I'm gay as f Hey, you really don't read DMs, but seeing someone who is tall and trans gives me so much hope. Thank you for making my day brighter. And oh boy, am I tall, aren't I? I am so tall. Minecraft or Team Fortress 2? Minecraft. If you were a sandwich, you'd be a sub. <laughs> you are lucky I don't know where you live. Have a fro. Good effort. Hello. Come on. Hello. Is five fucking letters. The people want to know, are you a sub? No, I am not a sub. I'm not a sub. How? How are they doing that? There's no message. That booty of yours though. It is truly spectacular. Gaze upon my magnificence! Don't ever set foot in northeastern Egypt. Noted. Hi, I'm 23 and I'm waiting to be defeated and dominated by a filthy trans slut. <sighs> Aren't we all? Is what I would say if I was a submissive. Got you! <laughs> oh, I'm dominant. So I guess that's a no. Dude. Did, did you seriously expect a response? You are so sexy. I'm in prison looking for a friend. Please respond. Well, there are no shortage of friends in prison, dude. All you gotta do is switch sides. I will buy you coffee. Just do it! Don't let your dreams be dreams! Don't do button surgery. It's not what they tell you. Please Google transgender bottom surgery photos and look at them. <sighs> but sometimes I feel like trolling. Let's see if we can wind this guy up. Wow, you really seem to have searched transgender bottom surgery photos quite a lot to be such an expert. Why would a totally straight male be searching transgender bottom surgery photos, I wonder? Just do your own research and look at how botched the surgeries are. Spiel about classic conservative talking points. Wow, you really are an expert. So when are you considering getting the surgery? None of the genuinely straight guys I know have had any interest in learning about it. You must be in the closet if you're so eager to know about it. Ah, the old you must be gay argument. Ah, the old quote their last statement but don't actually address it or make any effort to disprove it argument. As you could probably expect, I never got a response after that. Reminder that I'm getting bottom surgery and I'm going to be documenting the entire experience, good or bad, in a objective light. Why don't you hit the subscribe button and follow along and we can see if this guy was actually right. What are you waiting for? Your redress. Oh my god, the Terminator is back! He's trying to find me! You're not gonna get me, Arnold Schwarzenegger! <laughs> Try me. Bitch. Good girl, I want to carry you to your bed. Open your legs and make your pee pee hard and wet. Jesus Christ, am I glad I am getting bottom surgery soon so that I don't have to deal with DMs like this anymore? What the f? I'm trying to find that video that you said I was in. Can you send me the link and the time, please? Oh my god! It's my Libyan lover! He's back! <laughs> Holy shit! Now, I don't know how many of y'all have seen my third DMs episode, but it was my original special episode. It was my 500 subscriber special. 
we have now got 10 times that number. But in that episode, I ended up having a back and forth with some guy from Libya that opened with a message telling me that I was man, not woman. And by the end of it, I completely changed his mind. Not only did I get him to confess that he really just wanted to sleep with me, but I also got him to retract his original statement and say that I am a woman. The power of sexiness. And now he's back. He wants to know. Oh my God. Funny. Pretty crazy how far we've come. I've been watching your YouTube videos and I love them, but I was super curious what software or program you use to make your thumbnails. Would you believe it? I use paint.net like a mother f***ing G. Uh, can I say hi? No. You been f***ed hard yet? Yes! By the economy! This is very important. May I see your dog? He's a f***ing cat! It's a cat! His head's in front. He's a cat! Do you want to marry me? Not after seeing that mangled wreck of a penis. Hey broski, I was wondering if you're working with anyone for your OnlyFans. <laughs> I am. You should check out my OnlyFans, link in the description. It's so worth it. If you can find it. Cause you probably won't. Tacos, yes or no? All the things I've said on this channel and I am going to get cancelled for saying no to tacos! Non riesco a trovare su YouTube la tua pagina Alice in Wonderless ad bf. Come to see Registrata. <laughs> I understand exactly what you're saying. Alice, misogyny. Nice tits. What f***ing tits? Soon, someday, we shall rise up under your rule and take down Ohio and all world governments and give every trans person a blow high made from the skin of transphobes. Yes! Yes, we will! Let me recount to you my plan. Because some of you are new viewers and you might not be entirely clued in on the whole Ohio situation. Now, you see, there is a big problem in Ohio. Too many corn, too many big statues of random things that they somehow claim to be the world's biggest potato, when it's actually not a potato, it's made of fucking fiberglass. So many problems in Ohio. I am going to build an army of thousands, of tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, millions of people, millions of queer people, gays, bi's, trans, femboys, everyone that fits under the umbrella of LGBTQ. We're going to rise up, we're going to train, we're going to become extremely skilled warriors equipped with only the finest weaponry from Nerf and possibly X-Shot. And also maybe these guys that make this cool Winchester thing that I think is cool. And we're gonna take the world, because God knows the conservatives don't deserve it. We will rise and we will see ultimate glory. Ohio's first on the list. It doesn't deserve to stay independent. It will be annexed and we will rise glorious on top of the wave of destruction and we'll make the world a better place because I know what the world needs. We don't need voting. We just need me to make good decisions. Join my queer army and subscribe if this is the future you want to see. Hi, I've been wondering if I should send this message for probably over six months. But your videos are really nice and helped me come to terms with me being transgender. You have helped me see being trans in a more positive way. And I really do appreciate your YouTube channel. You are so welcome. Hi, I'd like to buy you coffee. Just do it. Just do it. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Just wanted to say I love your content. The fact that you just tell the world to piss off makes me smile. Smiles are cute. Why don't we tell men to smile more? By the way, I'm a straight guy and I think you are beautiful. Perhaps I'm not as straight as I think. Perhaps you're not as smart as you think because if you had a half a brain, you would realize that being attracted to someone who identifies as a woman while you're a man still makes you straight. Go suck a cock, but not mine because well, by the time this video is out, it'll have been cut off. You're a cutie and sexy content? Jesus, people really want to see me naked, don't they? Hey, Dommy Mommy. I have a thing for spicy kiwi girls. Can you send over some feed pics? Preferably with a scrumptious drizzle of hot sauce and your toes inside of kiwis. What the f***?
Hot, chin up, I'd love to be able to come home to you. Too bad you'll only ever come home to a cold, sad flashlight. Can I send you a nude I just took? I was feeling really myself, lol. I appreciate more the ones that at least f***ing ask. I mean, like, this is rank, but I would still rank it above those that just send me an unsolicited dick pic. Why on earth would anyone buy you a coffee? I don't, I don't know. Just do it. Do you like to be my wife? Only if you increase your life insurance and stand over there just next to the edge of the balcony. It was an accident. Boa tart. Okay. Hi Alice, lowly submissive soldier from the Wisconsin Division. I believe I found a potential new supplier of armaments and munitions for your army. Glory to Supreme Dom slash Leader Alice. May your army never fall. I like this person. They know how to address me. I feel like my name, Alice, always, you know, it always seems a lot cooler when you put glorious somewhere in front of it. Sometimes with, you know, Supreme and Leader in between, you know, Glorious Supreme Leader Alice. I've even had people call me Mistress Glorious Supreme Leader Alice. Ah yes, X-Shot. I have been actually keeping a close eye on them. I'm very excited for their minigun thing to release in New Zealand. Do you mind if I compliment you? Only if you're on your knees like a good boy. I should buy you a coffee or we can go on a trip. Fucking do it! Why are there so many people DMing about buying me a coffee? I can't punch my hand anymore, it hurts. I can't take it anymore. My buy me a coffee link is in the description. Ow. Hey, I had a question about YouTube. How many of the trans content creators know each other? I have seen so many other YouTubers blend communities, but I haven't seen it with trans creators much. To be honest, I only really know Planet Walk. She reached out to me. I'd be excited to meet any of them though. I'm always down. Dang, baby daddy, wanna come all over that sexy face? No thanks, I've had cum in my eyes before. Would not recommend. Bubble butt redefined. Gaze upon my magnificent buttocks. My fabulous ass is simply unparalleled. Hiya, queen. Keep slaying. You are an inspiration. I will keep slaying. I'll never stop until there's none of them left. Girl, I don't know what you do, but your latest video, Femboy Memes, made me kind of fall in love with you. How do you do that? It's probably the digital love potion I mix into my editing in every video. It's a very heavy mix. Be wary of watching too many of my videos in a row. You may just fall in love with me. Sorry if this is weird, but you make me really excited for my transition and make me so hopeful on how it will turn out. Also, love your vids. Continue being awesome, little kiwi. Aww, you know what? I don't mind being called a little kiwi. That's cute. I'm, I'm big though. I'm big. I'm I'm massive. In response to a story about my bottom surgery, f off. Some people are really mad that I'm getting bottom surgery, like genuinely. I've had people message me being like, no, I was out to wife a trans girl that still had the big bit. It's like, F you, it's not about you. And you seriously thought you had a chance at all anyway? Hi, I'm French boy. Sorry, my English is bad. French alert, French alert. Get the tin foil! They're not gonna read my mind this time! Bonjour! Oh my god, another one! They're coming out of the walls! They're coming out of the goddamn walls! Hi, can I ask please for information glasses? These are Oscar Wiley Alia 301s. I actually have two pairs. I have a pair for everyday use that I just wear wherever, and I have a pair that I wear specifically in front of a camera. These have no lenses in them. That's so that I don't get lens reflections, because they really annoy me and obscure my makeup. Side effect of that is that I don't see very well right now, but I look bombing. Is this a NSFW account? Yes, I have, you know, I have failed seven occupational safety inspections. They don't like it when people do this. This is dangerous apparently, but this is an extremely important training method for the queer army. You gotta teach them balance, you know? Bottom? Do you wanna go to the bottom of the ocean? Cause that's where you're going if you keep saying like that. Just cause I'm getting bottom surgery doesn't mean I'm gonna become a bottom. Hi Alice, you look cute and smart. Shall we talk? Hmm. No. What? How? How are they sending me DMs without a message? It's literally worse than a hi. 
At least hi and hey were a message. This is impossible. No, <laughs> it's gotta stop. You will never be a woman, face the facts. You have zero female DNA, bone structure, hormones. No ability to get pregnant, Shut the f up, moron. Look, she has something you don't, a working vagina. Hmm. Troll Alice is coming out of the woodworks here. Oh my god, that's you? Holy sh**, you are so pretty. Oh, I'm jealous. It must be so nice having a real vagina. <laughs> I never got a response. Hey, uh, why do you wear makeup? No judgment. Because it's fun. I love painting my face and looking cute. It's just... I feel mystical. And when I use bright crazy colours, I feel like some sort of exotic animal or something. The exotic and rare New Zealand cat girl. That's right! It wouldn't be a subscriber milestone celebration without cat ears. Straight old married man, sometimes curious. Good to know. Oh my god. I'm not reading all of that. <laughs> I am a menace and I always follow through on my threats. <laughs> nice try. Bagels do not scare me. They are holy. Can I ask you a question? Are you in Texas? No, I'm not in fucking Texas. What? Why, why would you think I was in Texas? New Zealand or Kiwi is the first fucking thing in all of my profiles. And why is it always Texas? All of the ones that want to meet up and fuck me are from Texas. What's your favorite use of chopsticks? I love eating soup with them. The broth sticks to them so well. Though noodles kill the vibe for me. Also, I love eating cereal with them, though I usually opt for a fork anyway. I'm going to four open someone's mouth with a new disinfected pair of chopsticks. You need help. Stop it. Get some help. Do not sully the chopsticks. I love chopsticks. I always eat my sushi with chopsticks. I love your legs and small boobs. You really had to say that? You couldn't have just said, I love your legs. You had to say that I've got small boobs as well. You know, you may be trying to look all dominant, but as long as you're below me, you're submissive. And unfortunately for you, I'm taller than you. <sighs> Silly, really. To think that you're taller than me, you're not. I this camera stand is up at two meters tall right now. It is fully extended. And look at me, I'm literally towering upon you. How does it feel to be loomed down upon? I'm looming over you. Sit down and be a good little submissive. Thigh highs look so good on you, darling. Oh, I know, that's why I wear thigh highs. Nice ass. Thank you. You can't have it. It's mine. It is my ass, okay? You can't. Have it! No. <laughs> where, where are they coming from? How does this keep happening? This is not good. This is not okay. Why? Reddit, why do you allow that? Hello. Come on, dude. Hello is five letters. How did you get it wrong? I can't even imagine how hard it must be to face the rain when you're made of sugar. You know, okay. You know, I'll give you that one. That was smooth. That was smooth. Hello, Alice. Sorry, but I have defected to the finicky army. We don't take kindly to traitors around these parts. We take no mercy! P.S. You're a clever girl. If you blushed, that means you're... Wait, hang on a minute. No. F no. Just because I can take a compliment doesn't mean I'm submissive. The carriers are off now. Now there's no mercy. The real reason I wanted to chat with you about someone I believe is down under, same as you. I have been chatting with this guy. He has commented and interested in many of the sissy reddit sites. I am in the US. He enjoys chatting with transgenders and I thought maybe you would be okay if I got him someone closer. I know this might be asking a lot. I. Listen, just, just don't engage with chasers. Like, just don't even f***ing respond to them. Seriously, don't answer their messages. And for God's sake, 
If you have someone that's f annoying you, just block them. Don't try and palm them off to another person. Sometimes you just gotta be a bitch, okay? Vindo su video. Hello, voce a campo sozinia. Muito bacana ver sua experiencia. Parabéns. Soy bien. I legitimately struggle to watch Alice's videos because of how ridiculously excited I get while watching them. It's overwhelming. Okay, that is actually the most adorable thing I've ever seen. I love you. Holy f Oh, that's so cute. Holy shit! I never thought that you were from our country. It is literally the first thing written in all of my profiles. Why are people surprised that I'm from New Zealand? You're really pretty, but I guess I'm a bad person because I would still keep you a secret. That's just... Why... Why would you say that? Why go out of your way to say that to someone? I know that this is unsolicited, but I just gotta say, you are beyond adorable. I know. I swear, since I first saw you, it feels like my soul was entangled in your exquisite aura. I feel like I'm weak just glancing upon your wonderfulness. Most people do feel weak around me. I'm just that powerful. Look at me. Look at me in this hot pink suit. Do I not look like a boss babe? I'm a tough bitch. Thank you. Hello, how are you doing? Fine. Wow, rude. You answered your own question for me. I mean, to be fair, you were never gonna get an answer from me, so... I guess it's warranted. When I become rich, I marry you. We will need to rearrange your life insurance. And everywhere we go, you must stand precariously close to some sort of ledge. We call it ledging. You hate me. Sure, I guess. What a f***ing weird message. Hey, I just wanted to say, know that you will never have your period, never go through menopause, never experience the pain when giving birth to a child that has been growing in your body for nine months. You'll never experience what it's like to be hunted down by clouds of men. They follow you, they'll say anything for the chance of, excuse me, sleeping with you. The feeling of when being threatened by a man, being hopeless, since they are way stronger than you. If even you exercise your hardest, you reach only the average strength of a man. You know I gotta troll them. You really seem to have thought a lot about being hunted down and slept with by men. This seems like a fantasy you've lived out quite often seeing as how much detail you've managed to put in. I want you to know that I'm proud of you and will be here to support you when you come out. It's okay to dream of being hunted down by clouds of men. It's okay. You buffoon! You damage your body trying to achieve perfection in being female, but you wouldn't anyways. Nobody can see your genitals. They don't change who you are. God, dude, now you're thinking about my genitals? Quit it, dude. Why are you thinking about a trans girl's genitals? You know straight guys wouldn't do that, right? That got him to shut up. Hey, love. How are you? I feel enraged. So far today, we have had dozens of messages without messages, and we've had at least three French people. Random as f but do you sell customs? I'd love to see more of you and your beautiful feet and thigh highs. For a price, of course. For God's sake, you are never gonna see my nudes. Let me introduce myself. I'm from Vancouver, Canada. I'm six foot three, 275 pounds, light brown eyes, goatee, shaved head, and smile with dimples. Think of an offensive line man build. F is a line man. I look forward to hearing from you. Ha! Six foot three? That is chump change. Perfect tiny size for my army. You are so small that we can package you up in a cute little maid outfit and you will be perfect for scouting out through the sewers and getting underneath the enemy in urban fighting scenarios. I love small people. Hi, Alice in the Wonderland. Something just feels off about this message. Something just, it just feels weird. It just feels weird. What is that message? Hi, Alice in the Wonderland. It doesn't sound like a human thing to say. That's like uncanny valley mode. Sometimes you get hate on the web, but those fools are saying meaningless bleb. You are amazing just as you are, shining brighter than the brightest star. Hopefully you without hate can freely roam. That's what I wanted to say, so I wrote this poem. I love you, that's adorable. Thank you. Hi, I saw your photos and you are so much beauty and cute. I'm 25 yo from Hungary. If I send Y pick, can Y rape me? Do guys actually get off to d rating? Really? Is that a thing? I've never seen that. Also, f***ing choice decision messaging a trans girl from Hungary, the country with the worst f***ing LGBT human rights track record imaginable. Damn, girl, if you explode with shrimp, that'd be disappointing. That really would be shrimply devastating. For I am one in a Krillian, and I can't be replaced. Not by such shrimpletons. <laughs> oh, 
I deserve to be tried for war crimes just because of those jokes. Oh my god. Puns. Oh no. With the invasion of Ohio impending, I would like to make a request to lead a division of the queer army to conquer Cedar Point. Cedar Point is a famous theme park on the north side of Ohio in Sandusky. As a roller coaster enthusiast, I am well suited to running the park once we have taken over Ohio, and I have many changes I would like to make to turn it into the ultimate LGBTQ plus theme park. This sounds like an excellent idea. I'm willing to part with government funds in order to make this a reality. Give us a holiday destination. We need morale in the queer army and having somewhere that we can put on a postcard that we can pin up in the barracks or in the trenches and people can think of when, you know, their friend is lying on the ground with a bullet in his shoulder. It just makes it all work, you know. Hey, you're honestly beautiful. Do you have spicy content? You know, I've actually been thinking of doing that. The Hot Ones podcast gets a lot of views. I was wondering if maybe I should try and make something similar. No, that's a terrible idea. I can't eat spicy food. Are you a giantess? Yes. Yes, indeed I am. I am so tall. What do you want? You want me to get something off the top shelf? Do you want me to pick you up and pin you on the ground? I got you, fam. Are you up for some hot and wild sex? Jeez, these openers are just not getting any better, are they? They're just not getting any better. Bonjour, chérie. Tu va bien. No! No, not again. They never <laughs> gonna have my thoughts. How you doing, girl? How about we meet up and share a Slurpee out of my reusable 7-Eleven gold chrome cup? I would literally rather be caught by the French. I've changed my mind. Wait, hold on. Got you a straw too. I don't mind sharing a drink, but germs though? That's a no-no for me. Well, at least they're hygienic. Hello, how are you? Can you take me to live with you? Pretty. I will make you my pet. Come on, get down on your knees. Meow for me. Hi Alice, I'm looking to join your queer army. I don't bring much to the table, aside from having lived in Ohio for nine years. I'm willing to spy on the state for the army. <laughs> brilliant. We need insider information. This is... they could tell us the real reason why there are so many world's largest attractions in Ohio. They might know. Hello, do you love men? I control men. That's what I do. I know you know what I know. That Elon Musk is secretly an insectoid creature living under the sewers of Manhattan. And that he's actually slowly becoming quite a lot like a fat bug. Hey Alice, love the videos and good luck with the surgery. Aw, thank you so much. Hello my fellow trans flesh being. I just wanted to say that I think you look really pretty and I love your YouTube channel. Did you just call me a flesh being? Should I be offended? I cannot be attracted to a submissive because that would be submissive of me. Alice, this is my favorite quote of 2023 so far and yeah, you're spot on. Trans goth dom gifs that you can dom are Perfect. Ah, uh, see, so yeah, this one has the right idea. Yes, you know what's good. You know what's best for you. I must find a trans goth tall dommy mistress of whom I can control. You're short. That's it. That's, that's it. That's it. You asked for this. Shame. I'm tall. Fact. Remember that the next time any of you think of calling me short because I'm not short, I'm massive, I'm really f***ing tall and I will not have this slander against me. Hey Alice, I think you deserve to see something pretty like yourself so here is this nice sunset as thank you for being such an inspiration and I hope you will like it. Aww, I'm really glad that wasn't a d*** pic. Because with words like that I would have opened it. And I, I did open it, as you can see. If it had been a dick pic, I would have been defenseless. I'll carry you. Dude, get a fucking life. Get a job. Get a car. Get some friends. Get a hobby. Make something good out of your life. Pick up knitting. Everyone likes knitting. All of your friends will thank you for the cute little gifts you give them. Put on the maid outfit. Get some help. Stop it. Oh my god, what the f happened here? You hate me, you hates, you hates me, sorry and sorry Alice unbanned. I don't even know who you are. Never did that before, but how would you like to be my first? I am sexy with PhD in political science. My name is Nicoli. I see your profile and I liked what I see and my fantasy is to be with trans woman. PhD in political science, huh? Well why don't you politics my ass?
Holy sh**, bro, I'm fully straight, but goddamn, you got drip. Keep it up. Pro tip, don't, don't call a trans woman, bro. You will get publicly executed. Would you f me in my ass for the first time? I have a pretty thick ass for a guy, and I'm pretty hot, and have a nice body, and a femme-like body. But I'm straight, and into trans women, so I guess I'm bi. Oh, for God's sake. I hope I stop getting these when my dick is locked off. Please! How does anyone... How does anyone actually go to the lengths of typing out a message like that and look at it and think, yes, this is an okay thing to send to a stranger on the internet? What? And still I'm glad they do because it gives me content. <laughs> hey, cute Alice. I need to tell you how you're cute. You completely melt me. I'm Max from France. How are you? No! No! The French are coming! The French are coming after me! I can hear them! They're coming closer! Oh, they want to read my thoughts! You'll never know what I did on April the 17th of 2017! Gotta load the big guns! It's the only thing that will stop them! <laughs> You'll never take my brain alive! <laughs> They're coming. Hello, this is a friend. Come in. All right, and it is now time for a special new segment. A few weeks ago, I put out a post on my community asking you to send me the absolute worst DMs you have ever received. And boy oh boy, were there some absolutely shocking ones in there. I got easily 50 or 60, I've just kept probably the best, I think 14, and we're gonna go through them now. Seriously, this is f***ed. Are you trans? If so, would you rail the f*** out of me? I am trans, but fetishizing trans people is not a great way to start a conversation. Classic. Dude just wants rail. He just wants some good public transport. I don't see anything wrong here. Hey, you look gorgeous. I want you to make me gay. My friend, if you are on Grindr, I, I have some news for you. You're not gonna believe me. But if you're on Grindr, dude, you're probably already gay. For the next one, my friend Planerwalk, who I collabed with in this video, actually sent me a DM of her own that she received. Real funny. Yeah, okay. Okay, Nikki. Look, it was all part of my plan, right? Hi, I know it's insane, but would you poop in my mouth? What? What? Oh my god. What the f***? How unhinged must you be to think that that is an acceptable thing to send to s- Oh god. Hey, you free right now. Nothing sexual. Just want to worship your feet. You know, honestly, this seems f***ing tame in comparison to the last one. Had to slide through, pay my compliment to you sexy. You have me here in my prison cell wanting to take over you. The only action you're getting in prison, dude, is if you leave your rear end unattended. Okay, would you be down to step on my balls with all your weight and crush them under your feet? Ow! Oh my god. Oh my god. Is this normal? Is this... Is this just what happens on Grindr? Hello, how are you doing? I'm a very strict mistress who needs a loyal, total-minded, submissive slave to dominate into a BDSM, kinky fetish's lifestyle. Where can I find this woman? Is what I would say if I was actually a submissive. Ha! <laughs> I got you again? Oh, so f***ing pitiful. Honestly, the look on your faces, you should be shamed. I'm jerking off right now. Wanna watch me bust a nut for ya? Can you watch me come on a VC? Almost about to come, won't take long as I've been edging myself, just want someone to watch me come. Honestly, when the horny takes over, people just lose all sense of decency, don't they? 
it just goes out the window. Suddenly, something that seems reasonable seems unreasonable, and something that seems unreasonable seems reasonable. Why would someone send that? Oh, my friend sent this one in. He went to a shipwreck and his grandma commented on his Instagram story, wonder how many people drowned. What the f***, grandma? Hi, my name is Will. I'm 19 and I really need a dom that is going to control me and humiliate me. I like ball busting, choking, edging, teasing, pegging, chastity, deep throat, denial, humiliation, degrading, cum control, spanking, face sitting, breath play, spitting, scat, no sick, denial, CEI, post orgasm, torture, nipple play, SPH, feet, anything for you, I'll be your pathetic loser. Wow, that is a sales pitch and a half, isn't it? Oh boy, do I have a new occupation for you? This was a cover letter, wasn't it? You just sent me your CV. I can make your wildest dreams come true. You just need to join the queer army and sign your life away. You're not gonna die though, you're just gonna, you know, you might die. But it'll be for a good cause. Can you be my mistress dominant and I pay you nice amount? Dude, come on, there, there, there are professional dominatrixes for a reason that actually make a business off of that. Don't ask me how I know that. Don't just message a random. Go, go find a professional. Oh my. I'm not even gonna read that out loud. <laughs> I had no idea Grindr was this bad. Holy sh**. This is terrible. Is this just like normal for Grindr? Maybe I need to make a f***ing trans girl reacts to her most disgusting DMs. Grindr edition. F***ing hell. This is just horrendous. Oh god. I'm only 1k away. I could park close by, tie myself up in the van, and you come in and face f**k me. The self-tie skill is commendable, but the rest is just asking to be organ harvested. Anyway, I think holy sh**, that is enough grinder DMs. I think if I show anything more, I'm gonna get demonetized and banned from YouTube. Wow, that was really bad. That was really f**king bad. But that's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for sticking with me along for 10 DM episodes, and thank you so, so much for 5,000 subscribers. This video might go out a little bit late in comparison to that. I'm still figuring things out because I've got surgery and whatnot. It happened about four days ago at the time of this recording, and I'm pretty blown away. <laughs> it was like a pretty massive milestone. Hope you enjoyed this extra long, super special episode. Of course, hit the like and subscribe buttons, ding the bell, leave a comment if you want to help me with the algorithm. And yeah, I guess that's that. It's just um, kind of an interesting feeling because this is going to be the last video I record before I leave for Thailand. So you know, by the time this video is live, that'll have all happened by now, but yeah, right now, yeah, I'm feeling, feeling pretty nervous, but I'm looking forward to it. Actually more nervous about the, the flight than the surgery, which is interesting. But anyway, I'm sure you'll all learn about that in my upcoming videos, nevertheless. If you want to support my channel and help me pay for that surgery, my buy me a coffee link is in the description. Really appreciate all the support I've gotten. You guys are absolutely amazing. And uh, without further ado, I suppose I'll see you in the next video. Probably without a penis that time.